um, one, of the play, one of their teams that I work with at the moment, you know, every single time they do a drill and they do it not precisely the way that I want it, I make them walk back and we start again. So a two hour training session can turn into a four hour training session, but they only do it once or twice because they only want it to last two hours. They don't want it to last four hours. So the fact that I'm so strict about how they perform their drills, every single drill, whether it's a range of motion activity or a core drill. So, you know, we want to have real attention to detail in terms of um, perfection of our, of our drills and how we do it. We'll do all of this today. So this is my biggest frustration. If we really get our athletes to focus and hone in on how they're doing every specific drill, and how it should be done and the benefit of that drill and how it's done, then we increase the efficiency. So it means that they're running just as quickly in the 80th minute of the game as they were in the third minute of the game. Okay, maximize efficiency and speed endurance. Increase the performance and decrease the overall risk of injury. So what is it that we need to educate the athletes on? Basically, what do you want them to do? How do you want them to, do, how do you want them to, to perform it? And why is it important for them to do this? And we all know that if we teach an athlete how doing this drill perfectly will actually increase their athletic performance, how it will make them a superstar, a better athlete, then they're going to want to do it. So I spend a lot of time on the why. This is why I want you to do this. This is how for you and, and in terms of your strengths and your weaknesses as a player, this is going to lift your game. 